Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm going to talk to you today about how China illegally entered South Korea's air identification zone today. This is according to the South China Morning Post. That's a Hong Kong-based newspaper and legitimate news source, by the way. And about 9, I would say around 9.03 a.m., they entered South Korea's air identification zone, and then they left it by about 2.05 p.m., they went and then they went into Japan's air identification zone. South Korea scram, scrambled the F-15K fighters as they should have. And what the scary part about this, this was not a reconnaissance aircraft. This was a transport aircraft, but they stayed in South Korea's airspace. Okay, this might mean that China is planning on staging an attack on South Korea and testing how quickly South Korea can catch the transport planes or if the transport planes can... Um, make it through South Korea's air defenses. Um, the, the reason that I say that is because China is still up in arms over the THAAD, which they shouldn't be. All the THAAD can do, as far as China goes, is monitor China's military movements. So unless China, if China wasn't up to anything shady, they could care less about the THAAD. They would send their people to go watch the 2018 Winter Olympics, which they're not doing. Their main reason only about not even 70% of the tickets have been filled because China's basically boycotting South Korea, which they shouldn't be, and it's disgraceful. All South Korea's trying to do is protect themselves. So thumbs up to South Korea for standing up to China on this. And it's just disgraceful how China's treating you guys. Hope everyone's doing well. Take care. God bless them. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.